All right, we're going to give everybody just a minute to get on here. We're going to start trying to do a quick five minute or so video in the mornings just to try to encourage uh, everybody in the Lord. I had a great service last night. Man, I apologize for the uh, difficulties we had last night with our live feed. Right in the middle of the service, our internet dropped, um, just shut down. I had to change over to the data stream on my phone. And that got us back up and going. Uh, and then I had to run around and uh, reset the modem and all that stuff after service was over. So, uh, man, I, I apologize for that. I, I don't know. And I don't know what else we could have done. But but anyway, that is that is what it is. All right, I am looking for our live stream to be on here. If you'll give me a moment. You saw where it came up, and I just got to find it. All right, just trying to make sure there we are. All right, just wanted to get where I could see if anybody had any comments. All right, we're going to wait just a minute, see if anybody is awake this morning. Uh, I'd like to share a verse of Scripture with you, uh, and then pray with you, just kind of encourage you this morning uh, as we just seek the Lord. I know things are continuing to progress as far as the spread of uh, this virus. Uh, estimates estimates are not looking wonderful, uh, but we'll trust the Lord that He'll He'll provide all that we need. Uh, all right, again, I'm going to give everybody just a minute. I don't see I don't see anybody else jumping on here just yet, but uh, you can watch and uh, it'll be posted online so you can pick it up as you as you have opportunity. I just wanted to share a verse of scripture with you. I was looking this morning uh, back over in Ephesians chapter 6. I don't know. It just seems like I've been in Ephesians chapter 6 quite a bit the last few weeks. Um, just The Lord just keeps bringing me back here. Uh, and I was reading the latter part of this passage. Now, you remember, uh, you remember that Ephesians chapter 6 deals with the armor of God and uh, fighting against the wiles of the devil. Now, it looks like some folks are waking up. I'm glad that you're with us. Uh, glad that you're here this morning. Uh, if you would just kind of sign in, let me know that you're here. Well, good, Miss Peggy, how you feeling this morning? Hope you're doing better. Uh, Miss Janae, good to see you there. Hey, there's Miss Christy. She's on. Miss Donna McCoy. Uh, John Mays, good to see you with us this morning. Yeah, now folks are coming along. Uh, yeah, that coffee's kicking in. All right. <laughs> I understand. Oh, good morning, Miss Christy. Um, again, we're just going to try to be a little bit of an encouragement this morning, kind of touch base with you, let you know how things are going. Good, Miss Peggy, glad you're doing better. Been praying for you. We had prayer for you last night. Uh, just want to take you to the, to the Lord, to the throne room of God, and just touch heaven for you, as we talked about last night in the service. Uh, Ephesians chapter 6 is the verse that I wanted to, to or uh, the passage that I wanted to read uh, this morning, just to kind of give us a, a, an encouragement and Ephesians chapter 6, again, I'll pick up where I, where I was. Remember, it, it's dealing with the armor of God and how God wants to, to protect us. But Austin, good to see you, sir. Uh, Miss Barbara Jones, glad you're with us. Uh, no tempt today, Miss Peggy. Thank God. Uh, aren't we glad we have a Savior that protects us? Uh, we're looking forward to, to what he's going to continue to do. Ephesians chapter 6, verse number 17 is the end part, the bar bottom part of that passage on the armor of God verse 17 it simply says this and take the helmet of salvation and the sword of the spirit which is the word of God so he, he gives us this conclusion of this armor of God and then he says in verse 18 praying always with all prayer and supplication in the spirit and watching thereunto with all perseverance and supplication for all saints and for me that utterance may be given unto me that I may open my mouth boldly to make known the mystery of the gospel for which I am an ambassador in bonds, that therein I may speak boldly as I ought to speak. Verse 18 talks about this idea of praying, praying for each other. What a joy it is just to be able to have an opportunity to pray uh, and to seek God's face. Uh, I hope and I, I, I know and I've heard that many of you are praying for each other. My desire is that we encourage each other to lift each other 
to the Lord, but not only just to pray, but to also be able to uh, communicate with each other. Uh, let's make sure that we're letting each other know that we're praying for them, uh, that we are uh, concerned about them, that, you know, let, let's make our phone calls, let's uh, uh, keep that communication open so uh, we know that, that things are going well with others and that we can continue to pray for them openly. What a joy it is. I, I've got somebody knocking on the door. Brother Kevin Thomas is at the door, came by to pick up some things. So we're going to pray real quick and we're going to slip out. H hold on just a second. Let me holler at him. Brother Kevin, I'll be with you in just a second. All right, so uh, I inadvertently uh, did not give him the proper, uh, they, they borrowed a, a lapel mic from us for their tra their uh, FM transmitter, and I in inadvertently gave them the wrong uh, AC adapter, so that was my fault, so he came by to pick that up. Uh, so let's go ahead and have a word of prayer today. Uh, I just want to encourage all of you, Brother Adam, Brother, uh, Brother Mickey, Miss Emma, glad you are watching this morning. Just want to encourage you this morning uh, just to allow uh, well, that wasn't Brother Kevin. I'm sorry. That was uh, the folks here to spray the building for pests. Uh, I might want to watch myself, huh? They might get me. Uh, so let's go ahead and have a word of prayer. Uh, and I just want to encourage you this morning. Keep your eyes on the Lord. Uh, let's just trust Him. Uh, let Him work in our lives. Give Him grace and, to give us grace and strength this morning uh, that we might continue to pray for each other and uplift each other in the grace of the Lord. Uh, I just want to encourage you this morning. Let's pray. Father, we're thankful for the day. What a joy it's been just to be able to take a minute uh, and, and to meet with your folks. I pray that you'll bless, have your will in your way today. Give us all comfort and strength. Father, I pray that you'll help us today as we just seek to uh, to wait out the, the, the things that are going on. Uh, I pray that you'll uplift us, draw us closer to you. Give us a fresh communion with you today. Speak to our hearts and minds. Father, I pray that you'll be with our folks that you'll just continue to up, encourage them, uplift them. Uh, Father, I love you. I pray that you'll be with uh, our church in Jesus' name. Folks, I love you, and I'm just praying for you and, and praying that God will just continue to bless. You have a great day. Uh, boy, and I see some folks that are jumping on. Y'all, If you're just now getting on, you're probably going to need to go back and watch the video because we're about done. Uh, we love you. Thank you for uh, uh, just praying for us. Uh, Brother Jim Chipman, uh, good to see you, brother. Uh, the ramages are just getting on there. Uh, just we love you, praying for you. Just want to let you know that we're we're thinking about you. If if you need anything, let us know. We'll do what we need to do uh, to to help you out. Uh, I, we may be in the same situation as some of the rest of you, but uh, we're praying and, and the Lord will provide. All right, we're gonna have we're gonna we're gonna break now, uh, and we're gonna come back a little uh, again tomorrow morning. We're gonna try to do it about nine o'clock in the mornings. Uh, and we'll also be doing the email, so don't, don't forget about that. And Again, if you're not getting the email, let me know. Uh, we'll make sure that we start getting that out. All right, love you. I pray that you have a blessed day, uh, that everything would go well, uh, and that you would not, uh, not drive everybody around you too crazy, all right? Amen. God bless you. We love you.